I am Dr. Sundar, Consultant Nephrologist, Head of International Transplant Services of the Manipal Hospitals in Bangalore. The question, as I said, is when you do transplantation, there are two types of donor. One is called the live donor transplantation or a disease donor transplantation. In olden days, the disease donor was called cadaver transplantation because it used to come from a person who is brain dead and is called cadaver. Now, definitely when you have a chance between a living donor and a diseased donor, the best form of transplant is from a live donor. A person who is live and is well matched, like an identical twin, which is not possible. The second best would be coming from a diseased donor or a cadaver donor, which we call heart beating brain dead donor. Now, the success of transplant between living donor and diseased donor is definitely different. The ideal form of transplant is from a living donor. The second best is from disease donor, but definitely both types of donor, the transplantation is far, far superior than being on dialysis. There's no question at all. If somebody who's on dialysis, chance of dying at the end of one or five years are much higher than somebody having a transplant either from a living donor or from a disease donor. But the disease donor, the advantage of disease donor is that the donation is from a person who is brain dead. Otherwise, the person who is brain dead earlier before the law came in, the brain dead person was considered and the, the, the body was disposed of and the organs were wasted. This law allowing brain dead person to donate has made a lot of difference. So it is important that all of us pledge our organs and help this program.